who finally admitted giant popping boba with a floating feeling. Pop! On day one, I filled an ice tray with fruits, flowers, and sweet rice wine. Then I filled the tray up with sodium alginate solution. Then I kept it in the freezer overnight. On day two, I melted the ice box in calcium chloride solution. Then I got some baking boba in this indescribable shape. <laughs> it's a cake. Maybe we can freeze the calcium chloride solution and store the bobas in sodium alginate solution instead. This is called reverse saffirification. The alginate will form a thin and delicate skin around the boba to hold the juice. Wait, what's this? Shift. On day 4, I tried to heat up the sodium alginate solution so that we can shorten the soaking time and get a popping boba with a thinner skin and a liquid feeling.